Nina, didn't I tell you not to call me on my days off? I know, but I really need help. I'm swamped with work. Apparently there's some high school reunion near Great Bear Lake and the kids are creating amateur lures. <laughs> Basically just trash, polluting the lake. The number of french fries I saw on the water, so far no one has fishing tags and... Oh, good luck with your fast food chain, Nina. I'm going back to sleep. No, I'm using the favor token. I hate you. The decoys with trail cams are... No. No! Do not throw another french fry into that lake, little man! Nina? Are you there? <sighs> Typical. Let's get to work. Hello, everybody. We are back here on Way of the Hunter. As of recording this video, I still am at the tail end of a cold, so you guys may notice my voice is a little bit different. Storage. But I am at a point where I think I'm pretty much better enough to where I can start making videos again. So let's go ahead and inspect this map. You guys may have noticed that we did do a video, or not necessarily a video, but a live stream on Way of the Hunter recently, checking out this map in early access. And uh, as of now, it is fully released, so we are going to get into the grind, trying to get some of those five stars and see all of the new animals in a bit more detail. We haven't really seen any giants yet. So I think what we are going to do is kind of walk down this main uh, river and road and try to get to this uh, point right here uh, for the mission. And on the way, we will kind of take down whatever animals we do end up finding. Well, we've got some caribou out there. I think we're going to go ahead and take this one right here. Even though there is always the chance that it could be good genetics, we want to get something down because I know a lot of you just want to be able to see these because not everybody's had a chance to play this map yet and maybe you're still on the fence as to whether or not you want to buy it. So we are going to take down a few of just kind of whatever we can find. And uh, this is going to be the first one. And just like that, dropped it on the spot. I do got to say from the five and a half hours that I played in early access, this map is probably going to be my new favorite. It is an incredibly beautiful map with a lot of good species. And uh, these are one of my favorite, the Barren Ground Caribou, along with the Sitka Deer. Those are probably my top two with Wood Bison trailing closely behind. But that is a decent way to start the day out with a nice looking uh, one star young. Honestly, even the small ones look really good for the Caribou, which is one of the reasons why I really love them. They did a fantastic job on them. You know, I saw somebody in my chat yesterday say that this map is the Silver Ridge Peaks of Way of the Hunter, and I kind of get what they mean. There is just animals at every single turn, and tons of them. We've got bison over here that are kind of hidden right now, but we've also got Sitka deer as well as moose. This area is loaded. You know, it's not too often that a game gets the Sitka deer right, but Way of the Hunter honestly has done that. They did a phenomenal job at giving an accurate depiction of what Sitka Blacktail Deer look like. A lot of them are much smaller, just like these, given these are all one stars, but still they actually gave them the size that I would expect out of Sitka Deer. Well, here is that Sitka Blacktail Deer that we took down. And honestly, this is exactly what I would expect out of a uh, small Sitka Blacktail Deer. Again, they really did a phenomenal job at making these just like I would expect them to be in real life. A Sitka Blacktail Deer are not a large deer. In fact, they're a smaller subspecies of the Colombian Blacktail Deer, which is already much smaller than like a mule deer. So they honestly did really good. I'd love to see a larger one so I can fully judge them. But from what I've seen from the smaller ones, they look very realistic. And it's really nice to see that a game has finally done justice to the Sitka Deer. We've got them in the Hunter Classic, and they look okay, but they're definitely not as nice as what I'm seeing here so far, so that's really good to see. We've got ourselves a one-star mature Alaskan moose out there. We are going to take that guy down, as uh, that one definitely does not have good genetics at all, and we don't want him to make future genetics bad. And just like that, the uh, Remington 700 long range just absolutely dropping him. I also think I did forget to mention we are using the Remington 700 long range as well as the Remington 1903, a couple of my favorite rifles in the entire game. So here is the Alaskan Moose. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. 
This honestly is one of the smaller ones that I've killed. I killed a few during early access and even the two stars look quite a bit bigger than what we've seen right here. Honestly, they've really done good with most of the species on this reserve and I gotta say it is my favorite reserve so far. I've really enjoyed the time that I've spent on it and I'm probably gonna play it quite a bit over the next coming weeks. Well, since it's here, let's go for this one star adult as well, even though there is the risk of it having good genetics. At this point, I just want to get down a bunch of the new animals. There we go. There is the second Alaskan moose of the day and this one. Oh, oh, that hurts. That hurts. Well, this is why you don't shoot adults. You wait till they're mature. Typically, you only want to shoot an adult or young if it's super wonky, and normally that is what we would do, but as this is a new map, I wanted to get down as many of these animals as I could so that you guys can see it, and, well, in some scenarios, that does come back to bite you. Well, we have made it to the next mission location. Let's go ahead and do this real quickly. There's the decoy. Now we just got to place down the trail cam and we got to find the best place to put it as there is three options here. This angle won't capture the license plate or the driver. All right, so definitely not that one then. Let's check more spots just to be sure. That is definitely the one that we use as I did do this mission. I always forget the name of that flower. During the uh, early access of this game or of this uh, reserve. There we go. Now we got to pick up the blue flowers near the road. Hey, quiz time. Alaska's state flower. Do you, do you remember its name? Myosotis something? So the Latin name is the one you remember? And the name Forget-Me-Not escaped your mind. That's it. My mind works in mysterious ways. Did you take care of the french fries incident? Eh, not yet. The kids stopped feeding the dogs after one bit them, <laughs> but I'm still checking fishing tags. One man is like that sleazy dude from last month who threw away the whole bucket of fish heads in front of us and said he wasn't fishing at all. Good luck with that. Oh, I should probably ask if you need my help, but I'm afraid you will use your favor token. No, it'll come in handy later. Thanks anyway. For now, we need to deal with that road shooter. No worries. I put the trail cam in just the right spot. And uh, Jackie? Are you picking flowers for that place again? No, no way. I'm getting some flowers for my front garden, actually. You know it'll only make you miserable, don't you? It won't. All right, so we're probably going to head over to this campsite, as there is a campsite down here. And then, I think, that will probably wrap it up. And there we go. We just discovered our very first campsite of this new reserve. And you guys know what that means. That is going to be the end of this video. But I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, be sure to subscribe to the channel as it does help out quite a lot. And also, it'll make sure that you guys will be able to see more of this content. I also uh, hope you guys have been enjoying Aurora Shores as this is a really cool map. I gotta say, it's definitely my favorite as of now. But we will see uh, how that holds up over the next few weeks. But thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all in the next one. Peace!